Hello everyone, in this tutorial, I will be showing you how to use the get tree function in Godot 4. The get tree function gives you access to the current scene tree, so let's start by printing our current scene. So, print get tree dot current scene. And if we press play, you'll see we have our main scene printed out right there. And obviously we can do much more, so next we'll change the scene. So, get tree dot change scene, let's do it to file, then we'll change it to our test scene. Press play. Now I'll change the current scene to the test scene. And since we have access to the entire scene tree, we can do things like pausing the game. So in this unhandled input event, we'll do get tree dot pause. This will get the opposite of get tree dot pause. So it's a flip flop. And for this to work properly, head over to your inspector really quickly. In the mode underneath the process, click always. And any of your other nodes need to be clicked on pausable instead of inherit. We can also use get tree to quit the game. So instead of get tree dot pause, we'll do get tree dot quit. If we run this, and press escape, the game will close. We can also call group functions. So here I just have five test nodes, all of which are in the same test group. And they all just have a simple function that prints out their name. So now we can do get tree dot call group, enter in the group name, which is test group, and then enter in their function name. So let's do test group function. Save that. Press run. Now press escape. And it'll call the function on all the members of the group. Another thing we can do is create a timer. So get tree dot create timer. Enter in the timer amount. So let's do one second and then dot timeout. We also want this to finish before running this code. So go to add in await. So now if we run, I'll press escape. And it'll wait one second before running the functions. Anyways, guys, I hope you found this story helpful. If you have questions or comments, please leave them down below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you.